Welcome to BSP Med. Today I am going to show you a project demo on Wi-Fi remote control. We use Wi-Fi mainly to check emails, update in Twitter, Facebook and WhatsApp and to listen songs and to even watch some videos. Now the technological advances made it possible to control devices from Wi-Fi. Let's see the functional block diagram. A smartphone is connected to the system through Wi-Fi router. The main benefit of having this configuration is that no need to connect and disconnect to the device whenever you want to control. Means, once the connection is established to the router, it's permanent. Second, you can even control the device from outside the Wi-Fi range through internet. And the third, it provides secured connection. Let's see the circuit diagram. Wi-Fi module is implemented using ESP8266 12A because of its low cost and ease of programming. It requires 3.3 volts power and some configuration pins has to be set to execute programs. It can be programmed through serial port. Driver circuit is implemented using MOC3021 optocoupler and BT136 track. Optocoupler provides isolation from the load to the controller. Track for switching an AC load. And the power supply is implemented using LM3017 3.3V regulator. Program is extremely simple and it is written in Arduino 1.6.1. Make sure to enter your router's SSID and a password here. Now select the board from the tools menu. Load MCU 1.0 ESP12 module and the COM port of your USB to serial converter. Now upload the program. Now it is uploading the sketch. Uploading done. Let's see the hardware. It consists of ESP8266 Wi Fi module and an opto track board to drive an AC load. The system requires two power supplies 5 volts for the circuit and 230 volts for a load. Let's power on. Once the power is applied to the system, Wi Fi module will connect to the router specified in the program. After the connection is established, the red LED will be on. Now we can connect to the device. Let's enter the IP address of the device which is assigned in the router by using MAC ID. IP address is 192.168.0.10. The web page embedded in the module will be loaded. Now we can control the device. Let's turn on and turn off. There is no need to type the IP address every time. Store this page in your home screen. For example, smartphone and save it. Now we can open the page and control the device. The system can be easily expanded to more channels, that is, more number of devices. If you have any doubts in the project, leave them in the comment section below. And you want to build this project? check the project description and thanks for watching this video if you like please thumbs up and subscribe see you next time until then don't forget keep learning